Hey, this is Nettie with Rocket Powered Sound. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a Fred Again style serum baseline preset thing. There will be a free download in the description for this as well if you guys want to go download that. Also, Rocket Powered Sound has an upcoming pack called Icons coming out on the 24th of October. It has a bunch of sounds inspired by EDM icons like Fred Again, Flume, and the Chainsmokers, and much more. So be sure to use the link in the description to join the waiting list so you can unlock thousands of sounds just like this. But anyway, without further ado, let's get into this. All right, here we go. So let's make this Fred Again preset here. So first thing we're going to do is... So what I have in mind, right, is um, if you have listened to Daniela, by Fred again. It has this little like bass line and I really like it and it really it really stuck with me. And we're gonna be kind of making something in that realm with like, you know, a lot of presets that you can like kind of morph it around a little bit, right? So um, let's start by, you know, just our in a preset. Well, just a saw wave. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna get the LFO one and we're gonna make a kind of like pattern like this where we have like four uh, little like spikes. I guess we could do it with two as well, but we'll, we'll go with four for just this example. And then we put that on level. And then and let's also put this at like 130 BPM. Now, the trick is going to be to line these up. I can't really see that well from here, so I'd have to like lean in really far um, to like see what I'm doing. But we kind of have this little like baseline going on. Now, the trick here, right, that makes this sound kind of like Daniela, is you take this, these like second and fourth uh, little peaks and you move them over to the right a bit. And that, what that's going to do is swing it. So, have a listen to this. Way, way groovier. And that's just by moving over these two little points. So that's going to be kind of the, the basis of this preset here. So, let's, uh, let's expand upon this a little bit. So, let's just add a bit of unison. And then let's get a filter and then we'll just plot that or we'll put LFO2 on the filter. And I think the unison might be kind of ruining it a bit. So let's, yeah, that sounds better. And we can maybe add a little bit of resonance to that. And then so let's get like one of these macros and we'll put that on the cutoff. And we can twist that to make it go like up and down a bit more so that we don't have to like automate this. Go into the FX tab, get a compressor just to beef it up a bit. Nice. Maybe a bit of hyperdimension. Just for that extra bit of serial width and we can maybe even distort it just a bit. We can maybe add, so let's call this, uh, let's title this uh, cutoff. So that we know like, you know, this is the, this is the the thing that sweeps it up and then we'll put like distortion here we'll, we'll, we'll label like crunch just to, just to kind of like act as like a bit of an umbrella term for both the distortion here and then also i want to automate the compression gain and high end just a little bit uh, i don't know if yeah you can kind of do that It's a little bit quiet so one thing i like to do is like take one of these like filters and then put the cutoff like all the way uh, up like this and then you can adjust the drive and this this will just act as, as like a basically a volume knob right so um when it's on when the crunch knob is on the lower position it's pretty quiet so we can just take like the drive knob thing and then like automate it like this so that like it's like loud now and when we turn it up it's going to be kind of on the quieter side so we, maybe not, maybe I'm not demonstrating this quite. There we go. That sounds nice. And let's turn the master down just a bit. Yeah, now we have this. That's So that sounds good. Um, and we could probably keep going with this. I mean, we could add a detune knob, for example. So let's, um, let's just put that on the mix and the detune right here. And now we can go from like, like a very dry sound. I feel like that kind of sound and then um yeah we again we could we could go for the sound but I'm, I'm gonna hold off on that and there you go we have the uh you know a little like daniela type for, you know fred again kind of uh preset so let's uh let's write a little baseline with this let's just put it on boom boom there you go <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, so super simple. Fred again preset for you guys. So yeah, this will be uh, linked in the description for you guys to download. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys learned something from this video uh, and I will see you guys in another video. Bye-bye.